firm or something on your ring. All right. Is that really your family crest? Yeah, right there. Look, oh, it's really a, pretty. Yeah, and then there's a little look at that. Isn't that great? All right. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> oh, you know what I didn't do tonight uh, is the emails. Yeah. I didn't do them. Do you want to do them? What are the, well, you, you, what? <laughs> Oh, you know this. Sure. You know, when they do the tweets and the emails, the people yeah. send them in. What are your emails? Do you tweet? Yeah, I do. No. Why not? Because it frightens me. <laughs> it does. I Why? think it's like serial killer frightens you, or just less. No, than I just that? don't think people need to know when I'm going to the restroom. I'm, what am I going to tweet? Like, hey, I'm now moving from room to room. I don't really know what I would tweet people. <laughs> what do you tweet people? I, I would like to know when you. <laughs> I guess, I mean, it makes sense, but no, I do not tweet. But go all right, on. All right, then. Well, listen, we have to play the jingle first or else... Uh, oh, well, I'll just do the jingle. I'm sick of the jingle. All right, are you ready? Go. Tweets and emails. All right. Uh, <laughs> uh, are you ready? Yeah, uh, this is This is for a dear, uh, dear Craig and Mila. That's yeah. amazing oh, they knew you. It's amazing. <laughs> My friend complained about getting a loofah for a gift. I said I, I like them and he made fun of me for it. Guys can't use loofahs? Oh, with question the question mark, mark loofahs? Yeah. I think guys can use loofahs. Can I, they? Why not? You got a scrub. What's so wrong with a loofah? In your pants. I guess. <laughs> Next. All right, this is from Juan in Cordoba in Argentina. Argentina. You ever been to Argentina? Wait, I have. Have you really? I'd yes. love to go to Argentina. Argentina and Brazil. I really? Uh-huh. I was I'd really young, though. Really? I, yeah, I was 15, maybe, or 16. What were you doing there? We did a press tour, first year of 70s. You were only 15 when you started that show? I was 14 when I started that show. Oh boy, really? Yeah, that was 13 years ago. <laughs> do you want me to do my finger gag one more time for no. you? Okay. No. Okay. No. You think so? I feel bad. Mm -hmm. 14. Uh, yeah. Well, here's, here's one, young lady. <laughs> This is from Juan in Cordoba in Argentina who yeah. says, uh, uh, oh man, I feel creepy. Dear Craig, <laughs> dear Craig, what kind of bird will they put on my Twitter? I hope it's not an owl. I hate owls. See, we put, there's a, um. <laughs> Do you like owls? I don't, I don't dislike owls. Do you like Harry Potter? Harry Potter? I do love Harry Potter. You know what? I, with his little I never liked it owls. and then I... You I never went, liked it? Well, at first, because I didn't know anything about it. I, I tend to approach everything with contempt. Yeah. And then... <laughs> And then I, I, I read them for my son, yeah. and, and I love them. They're great. They're really good. I know. Because in the movies, I'm like, eh. But, but even the movies are great for what they are, but the books are really, truly yeah, well they are books. fantastic. Yeah. And he's got an owl. Yes. So that's why they're not popular in Argentina. <laughs> <laughs> Who knew? Me. Oh, okay. All right, this is uh, from April in Long Neck in Delaware. Do, yeah. you, do you have a long neck? Do I don't think so. Very long neck. You could play a ballet dancer in a movie. I was 20 pounds lighter. My neck was a little bit smaller at that point. Do you carry weight on your neck? I, you do. <laughs> do you know a trick is to measure your waist, to know what jean size you want to wear, ladies. Measure your neck and double it. And that'll be your waist size. If you're like a 20 Why don't you just measure your waist? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think about that. I really well, yeah, you just go right. You, you got the tape right there. You're there. The tape's there. I don't know. In case you can't measure your waist, measure your neck, and then double it. <laughs> All over Australia, women are going, "Ah, oh, that's right, isn't it?" <laughs> We really, we really appreciate this. <laughs> All right, April in Long Neck says, uh, "Hey, yeah. Craig." Uh, and Mila, uh, have yeah. you ever had a conversation on the phone with someone and then realized it wasn't the person you thought? All the time. Really? Yeah. It happened two days ago. When they booked you for the show and you, and you, <laughs> and you thought it was the Tonight Show? Maybe. Kind of. Sure, I'll be there. Oh, don't. <laughs> Why? Who, who no, my I? phone scrambled all my phone numbers. When I connected my iPhone to my computer, I did something wrong where it literally re-scrambled my numbers where I put like my grandmother's number under my friend. It was like a complete mess. That's like a great plot for a movie. <laughs> no. No, it's not, no. Um, this is from Leslie in Tampa in Florida, all right? Why does Leslie have a duck? Well, this, look, you see, I, I guess we were going to put an owl, but we used it on the other guy. <laughs> She says, hey, Craig, I'm being dragged to a fortune teller by my co-worker. Have you ever been to a fortune teller? Have you ever been to a fortune teller? Yeah. Really? Yeah. There's what did they a, tell you? 
I can't remember because I think I was a little bit hoo -hoo, intoxicated. But um, it was in New York, and there's a really great little restaurant uh, on the lower, lower east side. And upstairs is a little fortune teller lady who's been there for like, I don't know, 15 years. But I don't remember what the restaurant's called, otherwise I would plug it. But it's a really funny... Okay, next email. No! <laughs> I'm interested. Are you, yeah. are you concerned about your future? Because you're going to do very well. You're going to win an Oscar for this movie. Everything's going to be awesome. That You can measure your neck twice. <laughs> add that together. I don't remember what she said, honestly. I think it was all fine. I think it was like, ooh, everything's great. Like, I don't know if it was very I think what they probably try and do, this is what they try and do, the, the unscrupulous fortune tellers, of which there are very few. Yeah. But um, what they try and do is they say, oh, you've got a curse on you, you have to come back. A curse? Yeah, a curse, you know. Who has curses nowadays? A curse, you know, like a, like a gypsy curse. <laughs> Well, okay, my fortune teller didn't tell me I had a curse. Well, maybe your fortune teller should have. Okay. <laughs> Go on. Maybe so. I'm trying to tell you that I am psychic. I can tell you I have a curse on you. No, you don't. You're going do you to be Do you ever fine. watch uh, The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills? I do. <laughs> oh, man. Do Talk you know about a going? curse. I know. But it's, it's, it's <laughs> terrible, isn't it? But great, but it's terrible. It's amazing. I, I mean, it's amazing. That um, woman who's just a lip and shoes? <laughs> But she's so sweet, and she loves she her sweet. daughter. But I don't know if she's sweet or she just kind of wants one up. But wait, did you see the episode where they were all at dinner at Camille's house, and yes. Camille brought her friend? For Ooh. The fortune teller. <laughs> who's told my... That fortune teller has told my fortune. Really? What? She was on the show, yeah. Her name is this, is, tr is, this, this is real? I swear this okay, is true. Okay, go ahead. Right, Alison Dubois is her yes. name, right? And when I started on the show, they she was one of the guests. Yes, but yeah, right. okay. it was at the beginning, uh, <laughs> and she was like, she was one of the guests, and she came on. The, I don't want to say bad things about her because she could. No, of course, her, no, 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 no. I think she's great. Yeah, no. I don't want to be cursed. No, no, you don't want that. No, no. no. You could do that. You look at my tattoo. I did. I didn't know you had a tattoo. Yeah, I got a tattoo. I always right? wanted a tattoo. Yeah, you can have one. <laughs> Okay, but wait, tell me All the story. Right. So she was on here, and uh, and they said, well, do you want her, and she offered to read my fortune, not on camera, uh, for the, you know, just because she was going to be on the show. And I I said, uh, all right. And she, she, we went to this hotel, and she read my fortune. And? Was it like? I can't really remember. <laughs> hmm. No, she, she said a lot of, a lot of things. That were spot on? Well, yeah, but she could have wikipedia me. <laughs> I don't know. No, she, she seemed to be uh, quite genuine. But I saw her on the, the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. And I know. Oh, so, my Lord. Yeah, well, then that happens. Is that going to happen to you when you get older? Are you going to become one of them trashy old drunk bros with plastic surgery? Let me say it here and now. Yeah? No. Well, when you say that now, but what happens no. later on when you develop alcoholism and a love for plastic surgery? Well, I then? hope you're there for me and you will I save will, me. I will. I will. Okay. Yeah. I really hope that doesn't happen. It won't happen. You'll be fine. But you have to make plans for how you're going to grow old. I didn't. And look what happened to me. <laughs> oh, yeah. I wanted I mean... to do 1230 on CBS. That was my big dream. No, I'm serious. You've got to make plans. What? I'm only 27. TikTok, girlfriend. <laughs> I'm screwed. Nah, <laughs> no you'll be sense. fine. You'll be fine. It'll be great. We're out of time. That's it? Yeah. yeah. Why does it go by so fast? If I could tell you the amount of time women have said that to me. <laughs> Mouth organ or awkward pause? Hmm? Mouth organ or awkward pause? Uh, awkward pause. Really? Yeah. You surprised me. Mm, interesting, you thought? I thought mouth organ. All right, give me mouth organ. All right, then I'll give you mouth organ. <laughs> but first here's the harmonica. Okay. I couldn't. I'm stupid. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be too great. It's a stupid joke. I'm sorry, Mr. Kunis. Okay. Here we go. All right. <laughs> Take your time. Take your time. Okay, you Don't just first. rush in there blowing and sucking and chewing. Take your time. <laughs> I'm telling you how to play the harmonica. Oh, my God. No, no, no. All right, ready? No. We're going to do a nice... Well, I'd like to do Waltzing Matilda for our new Australian viewers. All right? <laughs> Mia 
Lucas, everybody. Yeah.